We're still fighting Sir Tristan of the Aloha Knights. 1v1s. Okay. Huh. Well, I can't really well pass up these crit opportunities, but I don't think they're gonna do the damage I need. Wow, that is extremely unfortunate. Second life presence is intense. fighting uh, Lancelot then? Ah, uh, the scent of married women filling the air. It's everything I ever dreamed it would be. They're both married. I swear, you'd be so much prettier if you would never open your mouth. Now I see. Your plan was to distract me with married women while the wicked swan moved in for the kill. Ah, how this shames me. How could I not have seen that you were my true love all along? Don't be ridiculous, as if I would ever be your true love. Now hurry up and go down before I run you through for real. Go on. 
Uh, I'm impressed. I never expected you to defeat Sir Tristan. But what are you going to do now that you've exhausted your supply of beautiful young female fighters? I will admit there's a great part of you found women with an air of grief and sorrow about them. <laughs> but I've already seen the ones you have to offer. The same madam won't work twice. You do know that, don't you? We have MASH. The same madam won't work twice. Is there something deep about that? Come on, guys. Get it together. <laughs> not, not even. Forgive me. I nearly fell for the enemy's trap myself. <laughs> In many ways, Sir Lancelot and Sir Tristan are both Aloha Knights who are equally vulnerable to beautiful women. Uh, that's just because they're Aloha Knights, right? It's not like they always, they're always they always weak to them, right? However, it's also true that the same matter won't work twice. Indeed, I am imminently, imminently aware of that. And naturally, I've prepared accordingly. Alright, come on out! Mordred. Hell yeah! I'm here. I'm here too, I guess. I see, so you dragged Gareth into this. I did indeed. So you're an Aloha Knight of Casino Camelot now, a swimsuit sword master variant with a spirit origin just for summer. Right now, none of that matters. Whatever else you may be, you're still Sir Lancelot, Knight of the Round Table. Furthermore, you're currently materialized as a saber capable of rationality as opposed to your berserker form. As such, I expect you to have some feelings upon seeing Lady Gareth alive and well. Of course, the one you see here is but a shadow of the real Lady Gareth who has long since passed away, but she is still the spitting image of her living self. She may not technically be the same person anymore, but she still retains her thoughts, memories, and personality. Sir Lancelot. So, what will you do? Are you gonna turn your sword on her again, good knight? Remind me, how did you kill her last time? Did you cut her down where she stood? Or would you beat her to death instead? So much for your vaunted chivalry. Indeed, there was a time when ostensibly great and noble Sir Lancelot of the Round Table committed adultery. When Sir Agravain caught you red-handed, he and the other knights of the round table sought to bring you to justice, but you were forced to be reckoned with thanks to your eternal arms mastery. With naught but your fists alone, you slew fully armed knights, one after the other. Among them were Sir Agravain, the most the one most bent on capturing you, and Lady Gareth, who held you in the highest regard. Such a terrible, senseless tragedy. What really happened, Sir Lancelot? Did you beat Lady Gareth to death unwittingly, failing to realize who she was? Or were you fully aware she was the same Lady Gareth who admires you as a puppy and admires its master, even as you sullied those fair hands of her yours with her blood? That's enough. Stop it, Moriarty. Jesus Christ. Hmm. You think so? In here I thought I was being rather gentle, just as if I was speaking to a child. This is hardly the kind of lighthearted talk you'd expect to talk about when I put on this Aloha shirt. Yes, you're right. My sins could fill a vast deep ocean. Even my Hawaiian shirt will not allow me to escape them. Gareth, I. Sir Lancelot. Here, I'll put you out of your misery. You're wide open, Lancelot. I don't even need my demonic sword to kill you like this. <laughs> this is great. Having Gareth on my side really makes you clam up, doesn't it? Don't move a damn centimeter, Gareth. I'm counting on you to be my shield. Don't be ridiculous. I came here to fight just as much as you did. Oh, but I'm not here to kill anyone. I just want to release... Everyone from the Curse of Aloha. The Curse of Aloha? No, it's just a pet theory of mine. The Knights of the Round Table always look good no matter what they wear, but I still prefer them in shining armor. Hey, Mass, I'm sure you already know this, but don't bother listening to a word out of her mouth. She's a dumbass. Mordred, how dare you speak about your older sister like that? Stop that, both of you. We're up against Sir Lancelot, remember? This isn't the time to argue. Oh yeah, I guess you're right. She might be a scumbag, but he's still Sir Lancelot. Plan or not, we're gonna take him seriously. So come on, Gareth, let's get get him already. I'll be the one to lead here, thank you very much. Come on, Mordred. Sir Lancelot, I'm gonna come at you with everything I've got. Please make sure you do the same. For very well then, how about you? Curious. I almost like want to bring her along just to just to spice things up. But nah, we're we're gonna bring good old Berserker. And we have our surprise attack Robin Hood as well.
Instead of defense down, it's damage taken plus. Oh, interesting. How's that status read? Okay. Well done, Gareth. You've grown strong. No, you were always strong ever since that time. Sir Lancelot, you're much too kind. Hey, don't cry, dumbass. You want to give up our win after we clinched it? Clinched it without the E? Interesting. I think that's quite enough. Stand down, Sir Lancelot. Perhaps you could join cheerful Tristan for a breather. I'll take it from here. So you pitted wives against Tristan and Gareth against Lancelot. Well done, you certainly thought this through. But I must wonder, who will you pit against me?
The day is still young, thus I am prepared to greet you with full power of the Sacred Sword of the Sun. Yikes! Yeah, his magical energy is immense. Maybe we'll be better for the Rather than that, a powerful bounded field goes up around the entire casino. I see an invisible wall I couldn't get past when we first came to Vegas. So even though I can get into Camelot now that I beat the six of the seven sword beauties, indeed, would-be challenges are only permitted to enter during daytime, which is the same my time. So, how will you meet me? Man, usually I'd be first in line to fight a tough opponent even if I thought I had no chance of beating him. But this time, I hardly see a point when our opponent can cut us down before we even make a move. Now, now, no need to panic. You paid me to come up with a plan, and so, of course, I have one for him as well. We're gonna fight your sacred sword, Gawain. With a sacred sword of our own. Impressive. It seems you truly do wield the sacred sword of the sun, since you were able to defend against that strike. That voice. This aura. Wait, Arthur? Your sacred sword of the sun is very similar to the one I know, Gawain. Arthur Pendragon, His Majesty, the other king we came to this place from a far off world? About time the male version of my old man showed up, I was sweating bulls waiting for you to get here. Oh, so that's what that was about. So the bonus you mentioned was Arthur? I was only waiting for my turn, Mordred. Professor Moriarty is quite adamant about that. Well, you can hardly blame me for wanting to save the Sacred Sword as a final surprise. At any rate, I believe this would more than suffice for a lineup. Sir Gawain, or rather Aloha Knight Gawain, we are making our way through whether you like it or not. Very well then, I would certainly ask for no worthier opponent on my Sacred Sword of the Sun, I shall meet you with everything I have. Hey, you oaf, who cares about the Sacred Sword? If nothing else, I got you beat numbers-wise. Just you wait, you're gonna go down for you know what hit you. Hurrah! Yeah, four katanas, guarantees one Sacred Sword, cool. Just breaks all four of them in half with one swing. Whoops! Okay, well... We're gonna rock Arthur. And much as I would love to rock other people, uh let's go off him. So he's got a strong single target. Why not, right? not a swimsuit sword master for this. Yes, 
I gotta load this noble phantasm because I've never used it before. I gotta pull it from the server real quick. Whew! It's taking a while. Watch it say I gotta retry my connection to the server. Lol. Not gonna. I really feel like it's gonna do that. Certainly is taking a long time. Relatively tough fight. That's going to be one of the ultra high difficulties, I'm sure of it. <laughs> 